Hey what's up music creators? Picture this, you've just imported a MIDI file into FL Studio, excited to work on your latest masterpiece. But oh no, there's a problem. The time signature doesn't quite match, or maybe the tempo is all wrong. You've just imported a MIDI file that sounds like the one playing in the background. Fred not, because today, we're unveiling the incredible stretch feature in FL Studio's Piano Roll. In this comprehensive tutorial, we're going to tackle scenarios just like these. So whether you're correcting tempo mishaps or adjusting time signatures, the stretch feature has got you covered. Now, let's get to the star of the show, the stretch feature. It's like a secret weapon hiding right here in your Piano Roll. Once you select the contents of your Piano Roll, you'll notice these little arrows that appear at the end of your notes. That's the stretch feature, ready to work its magic. It's advisable to start with the drum or any other instrument that plays from the start to the end of the song. Now we can fix any timing or tempo issues. Drag this arrow until everything sounds synchronized. Drag the notes until each aligns with the grid like you can see on your screen. That's the easiest way to sync. The MIDI mismatch challenge can be such a nightmare. We've all been there, right? You recorded MIDI using an external metronome, and now your song has tempo information that just doesn't sync up. It can be a real headache. I remember one time I was having a good time on the piano. I created some new soulful melodies that drove me to tears. They were so deep and emotional. I copied them onto a flash drive and imported them into FL Studio only to realize each melody had its own tempo since I never used the metronome. I felt so devastated. I went back on the piano and tried to record them once more but since the melodies were spontaneous, they never sounded as good. But fear not because the stretch feature is here to save the day. Drag the notes until each aligns with the grid like you can see on your screen. That's the easiest way to sync. It's that magic wand that'll bring your MIDI back in line. Many years later I was able to bring the melodies back to life thanks to this feature. Open the piano roll and select all the notes. Drag the notes until each aligns with the grid like you can see on your screen. As we dive into the practical demonstration, Let's talk about the song that is our muse today. This City by Sam Fisher is a heartfelt track that's captured the essence of modern pop music. This song's MIDI demonstrates how the stretch feature can help you align your notes perfectly, even when the timing seems impossible. That's the easiest way to sync. That's how to stretch notes, maintaining pitch and ensuring that your MIDI fits snugly into your project regardless of the time signature or tempo. And there you have it, folks. The stretch feature in FL Studio's Piano Roll is your ultimate time and tempo savior. Whether you're rescuing MIDI from mismatched time signatures or fixing tempo disasters, this tool is a game changer. So, go ahead, give it a try, and don't forget to follow, like, and subscribe for more fantastic FL Studio tips and tricks. Remember, your music journey is all about learning and evolving. Until next time, keep creating, keep stretching those boundaries, and keep making beautiful music. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button, and I'll catch you in the next tutorial.